I cannot believe what bad luck I'm having in the state of California. I literally was just sitting in my car taking a second and some truck just came and completely blocked me in and taking up the rest of my spot. So oh, I moved my car so they wouldn't hit me because that would be the next thing that happens to me. I hope that doesn't happen. But my positive attitude is back. I've just arrived at the Beaumont Antique Mall. Let's go in and see what we can find. Looks like it's two part one. I'm gonna start in the smaller one next door. Well, this is the first case I see when I walk in, which is a good sign. Oh, there's some people going through some weird situations in here, it seems. All right, I like this though. I like where this is going. There's a lot of neat jewelry in here. Love the stick pin. Oh my gosh, look at that painting. That's fantastic. Okay, I like this place. Wait, marked down. Oh, okay, not everything 60% off. I was like, hold up. I like this little pottery vase. That's neat. Eight bucks. 1988. That's a cool look. I'm not sure if I'm ready to commit yet. Oh my gosh. This is what I was looking for. Okay, where do I begin? love everything happening here how neat i love this plate to my chief 15 that's fantastic i like this whole situation happening here very fun the prices are reasonable too so far i love this mushroom thing that's amazing the hanging planter that's at 30 dollars I feel like that's super reasonable. I feel like I could even make a couple bucks off that still. Maybe not enough to justify spending $30, but hmm. So much fun. Daisies and lemons, two of my favorite things. Oh my gosh, I love this wall art. Yes, this is definitely my vibe. Love the cat. Tanala cat, $12. 50% off. That's a cool one. Something's a little off about that though. Oh my gosh. Dog Central. What are the prices like though? Oh my gosh, wait, stop. Does this turn or I guess you have to get in there. That one with the hat, I'm trying to show you the glare. There you go. That's the price on that. I don't see a price probably on a sticker on the back not a good sign oh my gosh look at that bunny that one's at 45 though i love this top oh my gosh so fun some great clothing look at the bambi painting well i see a couple dresses i really like this one i don't know if that would fit me and then also this one looks a bit risque for me all right nothing there but let's go into this bad boy. I love the doors. Love the vibe in here. Oh my gosh. So much fun kitschy stuff. I love the little bisques. Those have to be pretty cheap for me to pick them up. I find them all the time for good deals. In Pennsylvania, I love the bear. I like where this is going. $19, the little juicer, I love that. And this is a really neat pin, is that a pin? Yeah, I'm looking for the price on it though. Oh, it says $8, I think I need to get in there, look at that, that's so neat. Wait, look at this, this is so cool. I love those, what's it? <laughs> Oh, there's some neat stuff in here. I think I'm still zoomed in. Uh, <gasps> the sailor necklace. All right, keys, please. People are having a lot of situations out here. So I'm going to wait for them to be free to open the case for me. So cute. $7 for two. I love those. Wait, what is this fabric? nine dollars that's legit too 
oh my gosh, this booth is so much fun. They're missing their eyes. What about the cats? 25. Oh, I love this. I love this and this and this. But also look at this fabulous pillow. $9 and it is pink. That's fantastic. It's super clean too. Kind of have to get that. I'm going to start a little pile after we go through the cases. If this person ever stops having a problem, I feel bad. They're dealing with a lot going on in here right now. How much is she? She's neat. 30. All right. Well, uh, I did pick up the sailor necklace. However, it is unpriced, so they have to call. I am going to get this pillow for $9. And then let's see what else we can find. There's some really neat little doodads in here. Uh, the cat fabric, I kind of have to get. Jigger clothespin travel kit. How fun. Okay, well, speaking of anchors, check these bad boys out. Oh my gosh. That is so neat, $25. I don't know if I can justify that. Um. I don't think I can. I love the beads in here. Where did I get this? I got that up here. I love the beads in here too. Look at this one. That is a dress clip, $20. It's amazing though. These Bakelite beads are amazing. $9. These are cool too. Six Bakelite clips. Well, I'm not sure about the bead situation. Oh my gosh, I'm making a mess. Yeah, I'm not sure about the bead situation, but I am gonna go ahead and pick up this cat fabric. I'm looking at the wrong thing, $9. Now let me get a better look at these towels. Salé de Ban. I don't know if I am familiar. So cute. Oh, I see. Oh, those are neat. Oh, those are cute. I'm gonna get these. And I almost missed the Hold Howard apples at $8.50. Well, the Holt Howard uh, apples had been repainted really poorly. So I, I just did decide to leave them, especially because they're not the most uncommon set. Wow, that's neat. Hmm. What's going on over here? Oh, there's a lot going on over here. Oh my gosh. Dude, stop. Oh, $22. I can't justify that, unfortunately. This one's at $24. For a collector, it's a no-brainer, but for me as a reseller, I think that's pretty close to what I'd get for it. I love the Milkman planter, though. Unfortunately, he's super broken. That's why it's $9.50. Dang, it's gonna be hard to walk away from that and that. And again, all the things I'm kind of eyeing in this case. Oh my gosh, the chess pen holder, that's amazing. They're all just a little too close for me to rationalize. Pretty close to, I would say very fair collector's prices. Now, I can't even get past this because I'm too focused on this. I need to see what the tag says. Damn, this is a very case-heavy place. Oh my gosh, the feather purse. Again, at $30, totally fair for a collector, but too close to what I would get for it after fees. That's probably around what I'd get for it after fees. I'm really enjoying the ambiance here though. Hopefully I see some stuff that's not in cases. Let's see. Some weird hobbyist stuff. <laughs> um, like whatever this is. <laughs> Interesting. This is a banana tray. Wow, I love that. That's fantastic. Oh my gosh, I love this case too. That uh, crown is spectacular. And the jewelry box. Wow, look at the lucite lighter in the golden club. Oh my gosh, wait, look at that lucite lighter with the levels. That one's at 45 though. And I have almost that exact same heart box underneath. It's hard to show things in cases. 
Um, <laughs> I think we all know what I'm looking at. Oh, wait, hold on. Oh, this got me again. This is only at $3.50. I kind of, since I've been attracted to it twice, I love the motif on it. At $3.50, I'm going to go ahead and pick that up. Miller Lime. It's just typewriter ribbon um, tins, but I love the galaxy theme to it. Okay, now I need to pay attention to this thing. I can't believe he's actually for sale. $149? That seems like a steal. I kind of want to get it, but my boyfriend would kill me if I came home with that. He'd be like, you've been complaining about not having space in your car this whole time, and you brought back that? <laughs> Look at all the Barbie cases. I'm not really a Barbie person, but these are really cool ones. They're older. I like this pink one. I think this is, what is this, Skipper? It's pretty damaged. Skipper, yeah. What's going on in this frame down here? Oh, that's not what I thought it was. Huh, interesting. These are in their original. Oh, those are neat. I love that they're in their original. Barveria wall plate, $12 very cool i normally wouldn't probably pay much mind to those but i love the fact that they're in their original packaging uh is this what i think it is Eighteen fifty. i thought it was one of those napiers this is really interesting hmm nineteen dollars I kind of feel like I could do something with that, even if I paid nineteen dollars for it. Huh? I'm on the fence. Okay, so I actually do think this is exactly what I think it is, and I do think it's Napier. I just don't think it's visibly marked. There's a couple other ones that are almost identical that don't have a bank name on the bottom, and they have a Napier sticker kind of want to take a chance on this well I have it under my arm I didn't leave it this Italian cat is huge $49 let me make sure I'm reading the prices right yeah because some of the tag numbers look like dollars at uh, dollar signs it's a little confusing for as being as tired as I am neat not man. Oh, that's ni nice, and it's only eight dollars. Some different stuff in here. Um. Oh my gosh, how much is that? One twenty-five. Is that right? That says one twenty-five. It's got a foot on its head. Wow, there's some really wild-looking stuff in here. I love the poodle and the cat. They look like they're at twenty. Three dollars each. Oh my gosh, look at this. Oh, I thought it was a perfume bottle. Still, the bud vase is amazing. Cute, but all very close to retail. Let's see what's going Oh my gosh, stop it. Just stop it. How much are you? $45. That's amazing. I love that so much. So freaking weird, man. All right. Now, over here, little elephant planter. $12. I love the bag situation here. Look at that one with the Art Deco print on it. Excuse me. And this one's amazing. This blue one. Oh my gosh. That belt. Is that $50? Dang, that's cool. I think I'm actually gonna take a look at it. Yeah. Well, as much as I wanted to, I could not justify $50 on the belt. It's more of an art piece than anything. Um, and I took another look at the sailor themed necklace and it was broken, so I don't really feel like paying $20 for a broken necklace. Oh, is this Rose Lane? $18.50 it is and they know it. Hmm. Interesting. 
Oh my gosh, stop it. How fantastic are you? She's cute too. I love her freckles. Well, very fun. I ended up spending $54 in there. I picked out like $12 worth of these really unique celluloid postcards at the end when I was checking out. Uh, I think I have time for one more. Then I'm gonna call it and get back to the desert for my whatnot sale.